Tiger Woods announced yesterday that he's had yet another surgery, this time on his ankle. Obviously not great news for anybody who wants to see the goat of golf ever play at a high level again. And the reason is because as I was reading about this surgery this morning, it said the reason you have the surgery, mm -hmm. basically, I'm not a doctor, all doctors watching, please forgive me, but they're basically taking a part of his ankle and fusing it together. And what Yikes. I read this morning is that you don't do that to – because it, it – <laughs> A normal ankle? No, no, no. It, it severely d limits the mobility in your ankle. This is not something that you do so that you can play golf. It's, it, so, it's something you can do so that you can live life in a more pain-free way. And this is all stemming back to the car wreck, it's right? A yeah. direct, okay. It's a direct um, result of the car accident when he rolled his vehicle um, in, in California a few years ago. Um, when you decide to have this surgery, I read, you are intentionally and knowingly sacrificing mobility in exchange for less pain. Obviously, golf, most sports, but golf included, mobility is wildly important. Um, when you're walking golf courses, it's best to be able to oh, yeah. move your ankle and your foot and your legs mm -hmm. um, as freely and as well as you can. And by having that surgery yesterday, he made all of that less likely. It, it's a basically a surgery you have to decide before you have it. What are you most interested in? Having full motion in your lower leg or living pain-free and if you have the surgery you're picking less pain and pairing it with less mobility in other words most times when we hear about athletes having a surgery it is to get them back to a place where they can do what they've been doing before tommy john surgery acl surgery it's it's you need to have the surgery to be able to do what you used to do. So that's why we're going to do it. The surgery Tiger Woods had yesterday, that's not what it's about. It's about, you know what, once we do this, you will never be able to move that the way you used to move it. But you won't hurt as much. Do you want to do it? And he said yes. And it's why when we had Michael Eaves on earlier in the week, Sports Center anchor who's going to be with us every Monday, who was at Augusta for the Masters a couple of weeks ago, he said he wouldn't be surprised if we see Tiger Woods retire from championship golf. Now, he could always, in theory, play on the Champions Tour when he's allowed to have a cart. But this surgery appears that it will make it more difficult than it's ever been for him to walk 18 holes. And if you saw him limping around Augusta National a few weeks ago, it was a sad sight. Oh, yeah. And you know, golf is a sport where – we are used to watching our legends play deep into their 40s, even into their 50s, sometimes into their 60s. Like Phil Mickelson just finished super high on the leaderboard in his 50s at the Masters a few weeks ago. That is not normal what Phil did, because I think what Phil did was actually unprecedented for somebody his age at the Masters. But it's not uh, that unique for a golfer to continue to play at a high level at a much more advanced age than the age Tiger Woods is at right now. But it seems unlikely that he's going to be able to, to do it. And this surgery yesterday um, is the latest bit of evidence of that. The recovery time, his agent, Tiger Woods' agent, said um, they have no timetable for a return to golf. Like, they're not even talking about that right now. They're just trying to get back. Like, the goal is not to return to golf. The goal is to live a pain-free life. But the if the goal were to play golf again, it almost certainly wouldn't be till 2024. Everything I read about this this morning is that um, if you're expecting to see him in the U.S. Open or the PGA Championship or the Open Championship in Europe, uh, maybe in 2024. But that's as soon as he went under the knife, as they say, uh, on yesterday, that, that basically eliminated him from, from the 2023 majors.